Oh yeah. Hey guys, uh, just going to be doing a quick tutorial on using Simple 360 NAND Flasher by Swizzy. This is version 1.2 that I've got. Uh, I'm going to be bringing my uh, Reset Glitch Hacked dashboard up from 14719. I'm going to take it up to 16197. And so you can see here, I'm on 14719, and I'm going to be using this USB stick in my 360 to run the software and pull the NAND off of my system, flash it over, Uh, on the computer using uh, JRunner and then I'm going to pull it back over here and put it onto the computer here or onto the 360 here so sorry a little distracted there I've got the uh, USB stick in and I've got uh, simple 360 NAND flasher just go and run that Okay, the nice thing about this is this is actually going to handle bad blocks if you have any. This uh, is a Jasper, uh, or actually, I'm sorry, it's a Falcon, and this one does have some bad blocks. It takes less than a minute to run, and it's just going to go out there, dump to the root of the uh, spot where the program was run. So in this case, I actually have it in a subfolder on the USB stick, and so it's going to dump flash dmp.bin like you can see there on the uh, on the screen it's going to dump that into that uh, into that folder where I started the program from so it's about to hit a, a bad block here in just a second there we go all right that's it so now I'm going to go ahead and hit any button that brings me back to Freestyle Dash and now I'm going to take it over to the computer. Alright so now back on the computer side you're going to plug in your USB device Click on the uh, load source file, bring your flash dump, drop it in there, pull it, drop your key in. You're going to choose the proper reset glitch hack version, either reset glitch hack or reset glitch hack 2. Choose your dash that you're going to be loading, choose glitch. If you have any uh, customization in your launch files make sure that you use your edited settings and then just go ahead and create image choose your board this is a Falcon hit OK image is ready go in now and you can just delete your flash dump you've already got it copied over and then you're going to go to your output folder and drop in your update flash bin just like that and then you're ready to go now we're going to go back over to the Xbox alright so now we're back on the Xbox uh, we're in freestyle you go into the file manager, go to the USB device, it's a simple 360 NAND flash, launch the default, and it asks you to press A if you want to flash your NAND with raw flash 4, press B if you want to safe flash your NAND with raw flash 4, dump and write, press X if you want to dump your NAND. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and flash the NAND.
press start to flash the NAND or anything else to exit. It's done. Took 35 seconds. And it is rebooting. Or actually shutting down. So you just turn it back on. And hope for the best. And there we go. <coughs> it didn't glitch the first time, so I had to turn it off, turn it back on. So we booted back up into freestyle, so that's a good sign. I'm going to hit the home button and press Y, go to yes and hold down the right bumper. Now I'm just going to hit B, scroll all the way over to settings, system, console settings, system info, and you can see that we are now on 16197. That's it.